Hello everyone and welcome to another computer tutorial for beginners. I'm Babbage from DigitalBrink.com and today we're going to be talking about dragging and dropping in Windows XP. Dragging and dropping is a very simple operation. Um, all you need is a mouse and some things to drag and drop on your computer. So what I'd first like to show you is just how you can drag and drop uh, items into a folder. So here you can see I've opened up the My Documents folder and I've got two items on the desktop, drag me and drag me to. Now if I want to move both of those files into the My Documents folder, all I have to do is left click on an open area on the desktop and while I'm holding the left click button on my mouse I just drag over uh, both of those two items. Now you can see that there's like a little rectangular area that's uh, become highlighted on the desktop. That just shows uh, all of the icons that are going to be encompassed by the area that we want. So you can see I've highlighted both of those two items. So now if I let go, they're both highlighted. Now I can click on one of the items and while still holding the left mouse button, I can drag both of those over into the My Documents folder. And if I let go inside of there, you can see I've moved both of those two documents from the desktop to the My Documents folder. So now I'm just going to move them back to the desktop. And see, all I did was I left click and held and dragged. And you can see there's a, a selection window here. And I can highlight whatever I really want to. But uh, for this purpose, I just highlighted those two documents. So now, a lot of programs support drag and drop capabilities. So now what I'm going to do is show you uh, how to drag and drop into a program. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up Notepad. And in Notepad, you can see right now it's an untitled document. It's brand new. There's no text in here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to take uh, one of these two files. I'm just going to take this drag me file. And I'm just going to left click on it once so that it's be highlighted. And while I'm still holding the left mouse click button, I'm just going to drag it over and drop it into the window. And you can see it's opened up the drag me text file. And this is the text that was in it. This is the drag me file. So um, you can see I just dragged and dropped it in there and now I can change whatever I want to in the file. And I can save it. And now if I close out of here and just reopen up Notepad. If I click on it again and drag it back in there and drop it, you can see it worked just fine. And really what you can do is, um, you can really do that with any file. You can see this is the drag me to file. I can just left click on it drag it over to uh, the notepad program and if I drop it in there it just works. So that's pretty much all there is to dragging and dropping. You can really do that with you know any type of file. You can see here I'm just gonna click on them and drag and drop them into the recycle bin. And It's a really simple operation but it really helps especially when you have to move uh, a lot of files from maybe one folder to another or if you want to delete a lot of files you can just drag them right into the recycle bin or drag certain files into a specific folder. So uh, I hope you've learned a little something here and uh, check out digitalrink.com for uh, new and additional tutorials. Thank you.